I thought I literally lost everything. Like literally all my projects gone in an instant. I'm going to walk you guys through what I did to save this project. So you open up DaVinci Resolve and you're trying to restore a project backup. First click on this and you try to locate where your backups are, which for me would be on my SSD. When you come in here you go into backups and you see everything grayed out, even the DB files. These are DB files. It should be working, right? This is my database. But the issue is, look at this. It has some sort of weird extension on here. In order to fix this, we're gonna go into our browser and download SRT Lite browser.org. This link is going to be in the description box below. And you're going to download according to the operating system that you are running right now. For me, I'm running Mac OS. You'll click on this link right here if you're running on Mac. If you're running on Windows, you're going to click on one of these. We're going to reveal and finder and find where your project library is living. We're going to click on user, guest, projects here's all my projects right and let's say that you want to bring up this with this project file everything in this folder contains all the information needed for this particular project now what we got to do is find out what the exact project name is and how we're going to find out is using srt light we're going to take this and drop it into our srt light Next, we're gonna go ahead and press browse data. And then we see this little table icon right here and this drop down. We're gonna go ahead and click this drop down. We're gonna scroll down to SM project. Now, on our SM project, we see our project name. So, this is the name of the project that you've been working on, and this is what the backup is. It says race against time pilot episode. Next thing that we're going to do is we're going to take this name. We're going to copy it. And we're going to create a new folder. And we're going to name this exactly what this is. Okay. Now we're going to double click on it. And we're going to bring in this DB file. Next thing you need to do is you need to rename this. All you have to do is delete these right here and keep just the .db file. And it'll come off of the pop-up and you say, yes, use db. Then you can close this out and you could press refresh. Now your project is right here, okay? So we're gonna double click on it and here it is guys, the project is fully restored. Everything that you have worked on, uh, your heart doesn't have to sink anymore. DaVinci Resolve is such a great, powerful tool. And you know, just like any other software, there's pros and cons to anything in the world, especially when it comes to software, because we're humans and humans are the ones that design it. My whole computer totally crashed. It had an error and I had to reinstall the whole Mac OS, which is the worst thing that you could ever possibly want to do. I backed up everything to an external hard drive and you know, all my projects are saved on an external hard drive for situations like this. When I reinstalled my Mac OS and reinstalled DaVinci Resolve, I thought, Oh yeah, it's going to work perfectly. I thought everything was going to be great, but guess what? It's in it. I went into my DaVinci Resolve home screen. I tried to refresh and restore my projects. It was all showing grayed out. Like you could not bring it up. I called Blackmagic Design. When I called them, they were no help. <laughs> They referred me to this forum and their forum page was no help because I couldn't find the exact solution. It was very, very frustrating to me. 
I thought I literally lost everything. Like literally all my projects gone in an instant. As you can imagine guys, your heart will sink at this moment. Because if you're working on a major project and next thing you know, your project backup is not working and nothing is working, it's a nightmare. If you ever find yourself in a similar situation, I really hope that this video has helped you. And if it does, you know, please yeah. subscribe to our channel, like this video, and click that bell notification icon. Also guys, the giveaway is still happening. I know, right? You guys can click the link in the description box below to enter. You're absolutely right. And you guys can have a chance to win a studio copy of DaVinci Resolve along with a speed editor. The winner is going to be announced here on the channel August 30th. Thanks for watching and remember guys to practice and create.